Hi, welcome back to my Alan Bradley PLC Test Manager. Today we're going to do a little bit of work with Panel View Plus memory modules and screens. Now I've got two here, and this one is an RP1. Hold it up this way, 24 volt, and it is 64k memory. This one is an RP2, 24 volt and 128 megabyte memory. And then I've got a 1250 screen. Now, the nice thing about these older, this older setup that Alan Bradley put together is everything's plug and play. Just because it says RP1 on it doesn't mean it has to be. These systems, this is the RP2, your memory that, you down, that you've downloaded, your program, is, resides on this CF card. This is your RAM. So in this one you can see it's a 2711P RW2. And this is says it's version 3.2 and 128 meg RAM chips. This one, same thing, this is an RW1 version 5, 64 megabyte, and this so these two match is 64 megabyte RAM. All you have to do to make this one into a RP2 is take the other card and the RAM and put them in here. You undo this screw, pop this out, take the other one, pop it in. Take the RAM out, and you've got a little clip on either side, and it just pops up when you've got good fingernails. And you take the, art, the 128 meg RAM, pop it in, now you've got an RP2. Uh, this battery, this is a CR2032, 3 volt battery. When you fire up your panel view and go into the diagnostics and terminal screen, they've got a utility in there <coughs> that shows you the voltage on the battery. I normally, before I send these out to a customer, I put a new battery in. New batteries are very inexpensive. You can pick them up at a corner store and this is an Energizer, um, Panasonic, Maxwell, they're all the same. The CR2032 has been around for a number of years, ever since computers came out. So that's all there is to it. Your Mac ID always stays um, the same. Your IP address changes with your CF card because it's downloaded that address. So to prove this all out um, I'll swing things around here, set them up and uh, we use this 1250 screen that I've got sitting here and uh, just give you a quick demonstration but uh, if you've worked with these before you know that that's all the info you need but I'll just show you anyway. <coughs> 